Hi, my name is Marianne Jordan. I am the content writer and teacher at Pronunciation Club. Thanks for uh, taking part in this uh, exhibitor update, Marianne. Uh, can I ask you, first of all, um, what your overall response to the pandemic has been in Pronunciation Club in general? <laughs> well, in particular. Um, panic like everybody else <laughs> all the past year but what we have done is um well firstly thank you to all the people that came to our stand last year and showed so much interest in, in the pronunciation teacher training that we were offering and so last year it was going to be well i've always taught it as a three-hour workshop either in the morning or afternoon uh, but of course we can't do in-house training um, now, so I've moved the, it to online. So instead of a three hour workshop, um, it's now going to be four one hour weekly lessons. Okay. Um, yeah, so that, that's actually going to be an awful lot better as well, because it will allow people to learn, have a much longer learning time, and I'll be able to check in weekly, because before with the workshops, I used to, at the end of it, uh, we, we check the sounds together and then I would have give my email details that they could contact me. Some did, not um, some people didn't, they were fine. But at least with this method now, we can do weekly checkups and, um, and I'm also adding on uh, monthly webinars as well. Okay, great. And um, of course, the change of medium has changed the way we, we teach. Uh, and not always uh, for the worst, because there are some different things that 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 uh, are possible in the in yeah. the new format. Um, how how has it changed the 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 approach to training that you are taking? Um, well, it's I've always been teaching online anyway through Skype, um, but what I did was I moved on to Zoom because that seems to be the most common one now for everybody to uh, to work with. I still use Skype, I still use Google Meet, just whatever the person wants. But I think for the um, the online training, um, I'll be definitely using Zoom for that as well. Um, well, I, I want to move on then and ask you about what two or three resources would you suggest um, uh, as helpful to schools or teachers at present? Uh, can be from Pronunciation Club or, or can be from elsewhere? Um, I think, well, from what we're doing now is, uh, is that we have the online course, it's available 24 seven. And there's lots of um, soundboards, flashcards, there's a whole um, load of materials there. And also for teachers to teach the course with um, lesson plans and so on. Um, yeah, and I think, and also this past year, I have been looking online um at a lot of you know training out there that like there is an awful lot of training going on now obviously everybody's moved online training and i would certainly recommend uh, the elt ireland uh, youtube videos because you've got a lot of materials there and a lot of help from other members of elt ireland yeah and uh, if people are looking for more information about um uh, about your activities where where would they find that uh on the website, which is uh, simply pronunciation.club. Uh, and then my last kind of big question is, uh, why are you supporting the ELT Ireland conference this year and uh, as, as in previous years? Um, I would support it every single year. And it's mainly because of the support that I get from ELT Ireland uh, with, um, you know, not just at the conference but throughout the year with a lot of with all the the web talks or lt l talks and so on um but i think from my experience over the last couple of years of the conference is just the quality of the speakers and the talks that they give they are very very informative uh sharing of ideas catching up with fellow professionals uh but the most important thing that i find is the support and friendship that I get out of the conference. Yeah, yeah. and that's it's it, 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 it's great for meeting, and uh, you know we always say that the coffee breaks are most important part of. Oh, uh, definitely, <laughs> it's, it is. It's it's just great, Peter. And I know this year you are going hard now and having 
you know, you have your challenges this year of offering that. And I wish you all the best in it. And don't worry if things go wrong with technology, we will get by, we will manage and um, we will find our own way of getting in touch with each other, you know, during the conference. I'm really, really looking forward to that part of it as well.